Welcome to our channel, Bong Programmers. Today's tutorial is for some data transfer related instructions of 8085 microprocessor. Let's start. Our first instruction is MOV. This instruction is used to copy the data from one register to another. Let's see how. MOV B space see it means the value at register c will be copied to register b okay our second instruction is mvi this is used to store 8-bit hexadecimal data directly in a register let's see how you can see here that it wants one register and the 8-bit data. I am giving the name of the register C and the 8-bit data I am giving here is 24H. Okay. It means the 24H data will be stored in register C. Okay. In 80H5 microprocessor, HL pair is the by default memory pointer. Let us see how to create a memory pointer. Here is the instruction LXI which is used to create memory pointer. This LXI instruction is used to store a memory address in a register pair. Let's see how LXI space we have to keep the first name of the register pair means the first register's name to create the memory pointer means LXI if I give B then the BC register will be used to store the 16-bit address okay then I'm giving B and the address is 1050H it means the 1050H will be stored in BC register pair and it will become a memory pointer let's see mm, how can I access the memory without any memory pointers there are also some instructions in 8085 to access memory without memory pointers let us see there is the instruction LTA which is used to store the data from a memory address to the accumulator directly let us see how here LDA and give the <coughs> 1050H means the memory location in this instruction the 1050H is the memory location and it will the data in this location will be directly transferred to the accumulator without the help of any other registers to store data from accumulator to memory we have an instruction that is sta it stores the data at accumulator to the register to the address i am giving that is 1060h it means the data at the accumulator will be stored in 1060H memory location. Let us see um, to store data. Some other instructions to store data. LDAX. This is used to store the data from the memory pointer to accumulator. Means if we use any other memory pointer excepting the HL register pair then we have then if we want to store the data from the pointer address to accumulator then we have to use this instruction this ldax press the first register name means b if i give this then the instruction will do that the mm, memory pointer bc which is point to the memory location the data at that memory location will be copied directly to the accumulator we have an, another instruction STAX which is we can copy the value at accumulator 
to the mm, memory address stored in a register pair if we done stax space d then it will <coughs> store the value at accumulator to the address stored in de register pair okay let's see for some other instruction using data transfer used for data transfer there is an instruction in which is used to take input from io ports let me see you the io ports here are the io ports 0010 02 and 03 which i have told you in the previous video here if we keep this address these are the address 0010 02 and 03 these are the address of this io ports if you put the address in here then mm, the microprocessor can take input from this io ports to accumulator directly let's see here is in 01h it helps to take input from 01 means this io port to accumulator directly there is a, another instruction that is out it helps <coughs> to give output through a output port from which value will be stored in accumulator will be displayed through this io ports if i am giving here 0 to h then the value at the accumulator will be displayed through this 0 to port okay these are the data transfer instructions for 8085 microprocessor okay thank you if you like our video then please subscribe our channel